Hi guys, thanks for coming back for my video. Uh, today I'm going to talk about Horus uh, new update firmware that has been released two days ago. So I'm going to highlight uh, three uh, best features that has been put in. Okay, um, let's go check it out. So the first one, the uh, course has been put in is the uh, battery status. Okay, the best battery status. So it will show our battery remaining and so on. So let me show you how to see. Where does it put? So you just press and uh, press and hold your back button. That is where you go to your tool menu. So go to your tool menu. You can find this battery usage. Okay. So go to your battery usage. So first thing here is you're gonna see the remaining battery. Okay, ninety nine percent. So from the graph here, you as you can see, as in today, it will show as in today. The uh, graph line will go down. Uh, further until the day remaining. So they will show you how what is the graph healthy like, okay, until to the last uh, remaining, okay. And then if you drop down, that is, we will show you the description of remaining power, the remaining battery, and the estimated of uh, daily use. If you don't use uh, activity GPS, 30 days, uh, maximum, yes, also 30 days, yes, it's on the exact uh, on our spreadsheet. And also, if you use GPS, it will tell you how many GPS uh, hours is left. So, yes, it's correct. Apex Pro can last 40 hours for full battery charge. And my last charge is yesterday, yeah, it's correct, it's on the, see, on the 29th of March. Okay, my last charge, and is uh, yeah, since that one day ago, yes, it showed one day ago, it's correct. Right, and it will show more details on uh, how many percentage on uh, the usage on the back, uh, on the watch features. Like backlight, it will be the most because we always up and down, switch on the light off and off. So this is the most. Uh, the second one will be the workout. Okay, the workout will be the most as well, and the daily heart rate because uh, this one run every uh, two minutes per interval and plus the system software. Right, so this is the the first one that has been put in. Right, the second one here is the uh, you know that uh, in our watch we have uh, a lot of our this uh, watch uh, these activities uh, has been listed everything. So you, you when you say you want to go for like mountain climb, but the thing that you did go went all the way up here, and you need just need to drag all the way down. So some unused activities you actually you want to get rid of it. So yes, uh, Chorus has made this update. Not me here. Even the tool menu here, they also can be customized. Okay, you can get rid of those you doesn't want. So how does it do it? Go to your Chorus app. You go to your watch, this your watch features here, and you see at your customizations. Come to your customizations, so select your customizations. So as you can see here, there is two of them. So it's a workout menu and the toolbox. So let me start from the workout menu. So as you can see, I have been done some update, but anyway, I restored everything back to normal. Okay, so everything will parking back to the default. Okay, the default way. So everything will be in my watch. All the activities in my watch. So for example, I doesn't want any uh, activity on the menu, so I can get rid of it and then easy to scroll in. So like for example, I don't want to ski, I don't want to snow, I don't want to XC, I don't want to ski trolling, I don't want the multi sports, I don't want open water swimming. Okay, so once I'm done, all the selected will be into the hidden workout mode. So all this will be in the folder. So next one. Before after you're done, I should save button. Yeah, save and go back. And we go back to our watch. As you can see, just now we have been disabled the scheme. Okay? So when I drop down, I will not see the scheme. See, no more skiing, no more assisting, no more posting. No, uh, yeah, pushing up the open water is not. So when they gone, they gone to the last one that will become showing the more. So the more will show the rest of the one we carry. 
Yes, that is where it is stored. Right? So now we go to the tool menu. How do we customize our tools menu? Okay, so this is our tools menu. So yeah, let me restore back. Okay, back to original. This is what we showing up from the tool menu. So yeah, there's a lot. Maybe some of that I we do not reuse. Okay, so let me customize myself. I don't want the do not disturb. I don't want the LTT performance. I don't want the timer. Uh, I don't want the walk face. Okay, so once I'm done, you just press save. Okay, save. So immediately in your watch, press and press and hold that button. As you can see here, you don't find any more. Now those are very scary. So where do you go? Yeah, go to the more button. That is where that store. The story at the more button. So these are the things that I don't want to use. So they all went to the more button. So when you press back, go back. You will go back to the one that you will show on your two menus, right? Okay. So this is the second top features. So the last one here is the nutrition alert. Nutrition is very good. Uh, alert is to alert us when to drink. And when when we want to drink, because we have our own time for drinking and nutrition, nutrition, and our on the race as well, we have no time to go look at our watch. So we need time alert first. So how does it this feature show? Is in showing at the run features at the setting, and you can see activity alert. And you will see the last one here. See nutrition alert. So you can set by time. Okay, you can set by time. So let's say you want a half hour, one sip of water. So you need to switch it off, switch it on. So then you will alert after the thirty minutes run. Okay. So this nutrition alert only will have uh, certain uh, certain activities like run, to run, to run. They also will show uh, the nutrition alert. Okay. So and then the the last the next one is the hiking and the bike. That's all. Only these four will show uh, the nutrition. Alert. The rest don't have. Okay, right. So thanks for watching my channel and thanks for subscribing my channel. So for those who are not yet subscribed, please like my video and like my video and subscribe my channel. Okay, I will see you next video. Okay, bye bye.